close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. Everybody's here. You can go. Okay. Um, I think you just want to go straight to Quartzburg, right? Yeah, that's fine. Y'all can go ahead and Okay, we've got to go to, we're going to the long-term area to dump and get water. I don't know where everybody else is going. Um, when we get into Quartzsite, if you have to do anything, I guess you could go ahead and do it, and then we'll, um, I guess meet back up somewhere in Quartzsite. Just keep your walkie-talkies on or something. Dina was saying that we can just go hang out at long-term today. That's fine. We can all go to long-term. I didn't know who wanted to go to long-term, so if you don't want to go to long-term, I guess just meet us later. They don't give you a uh, hard time about going for the day. It's just at night. Right. We're, we're going to go dump and get water, and then I think, actually, we may run down and go get our mail at Aramburg, because I need to get mail out for the day. <laughs> We are going through the checkpoint. Canine on duty. Restrain your pets. Oh. Bumpity bumpity. Oh. Oh. They were in the building. Wasn't even really anybody at the station. Welcome back to the city limits of Port Sight, Arizona. We are turning into the LTVA which is an acronym for, thanks Beverly, for Long-Term Visitor Area. And this is La Posa South. Tyrion Scott. I'm heading to Ehrenberg for laundry, guys. Roger. See you there. Your feet turn left. Okay, so we're here. Tyrion Scott already have their permit and it's the seasonal permit. I'm gonna wait on mine and get it later. 
because I'm only going to do the two week permit so I don't want to go ahead and get it since I'll be going to Ehrenberg for the cleanup. There once again is the prices. Long term permit is 180 for seasonal and short term which Somebody is anything in here. two weeks is $40. What was that? Government shutdown. The sign says nobody's there. It's free for all in the BLM. <laughs> oh, nobody's in the office today? No, it's government shutdown. Oh, that's right. It is a government shutdown. I'd be like that. Oh, jeez. Up here and get water and come. And I don't know where Carolyn's at. Say hi to her. Yeah, I wanted to say hey to Carolyn as well. Um, and then head. I go. I I see her. She's way over there. She's where Seth used to be. I think that's her. Anyways, I don't know. So many white vans. I advise you not showing up to anyone in a uh, white van. Yes, I won't go running up this time. I'll, I'll make sure it's her before I <laughs> say, where's Carolyn? While Terry and Scott are dumping, I'm going to come over and say hello to Carolyn real quick. Before we head over to Ehrenberg. Yeah, with the park. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I know. Lick it's too mic. much. Lick that mic. Too much. What's that? <laughs> for a sticker. Yes, and here it is. Awesome, awesome. Cool. I still love my keychain. <laughs> cool, cool. It was definitely fun hanging with the gang, but we have to head to Ehrenberg before it gets too late. Hi, I'm Rob from Oklahoma's Camping Adventures. Onward bound. Hi, I'm Vicki from Louisiana oh, no. with Ran with Vic RV Adventures. Hi, I'm Marie from Oklahoma. It's Camping Adventures. Onward, Onward bound. bound. Yay! Oh, uh, you can get on, but you could have just went straight to get on 10. Yeah, you should have just went over the bridge and then you would have been able to get off. But this is the tent area, so this is pretty cool, though. Yeah, it didn't even give me that option.
welcome to Osh's Drive and Look Tour. Speaking of look, if you look to your left, there is the famous Dome Rock. We're here at the Laundry Mall. Now Terry and Scott have a P.O. box here and I got two Christmas cards. One from Connie and one from Betty. Thank you. Happy Holidays. I appreciate the cards. Cute little puppy. <laughs> Angels! Exit the traffic circle onto Ehrenberg, Cibola Road. This is the frontage road. Continue on Ehrenberg, Cibola Road for two miles. Thanks, Beverly. This is the frontage road. Like I said before in a previous video, this road goes um, for a little bit, and then it turns into a dead, not a dead end, it says dead end, but it turns into a dirt road. And then that's where BLM starts. So we're gonna go about two miles down this road. Oh, bumpy. Should be turning into a dirt road soon. I think right when we turn this corner up here. Oopsie. Yep, here it is. Pavement ends. So we're just going to follow this for about two miles. Well, actually, it says 1.7 miles. End of Arizona Department of Transportation Maintenance. This is great BLM land. There's a lot of room out here. This is where the campsite cleanup is going to be held. Although I do enjoy the river site better because obviously it's right by the river. It seems cooler there too. I guess because of being right by the river. Alright, we have about a mile and a half to go. There is marker 305. Ugh. So there's a Y in the road. You want to follow the right side. Uh, primitive road. Caution your own risk. Do not enter when flooded. Oh my god, it's so shaky. I better slow down a bit. Yeah, this is not the best road for filming. <laughs> 600 feet, turn left. So, from where we were at the Y to here is... Oh, sorry. Hold on. About um, a quarter of a mile. So here it is right here. There's a bunch of people out straight ahead, but we're supposed to turn here. I think that's where some of our friends are camping. I don't know if I want to go down there though. Hmm. Hold on. So it says to take a left and go that way. That's where we used to camp, but um, there's a bunch of RVs down here straight ahead about um, a quarter of a mile. Yeah, actually, that's where we were 
was before I left, but I think while I was going to Yuma, they moved. So yeah, keep going. Roger. Yeah, the pin that you were telling me was like a half a mile down that road. It already seems um, like it's starting to get busy. Yeah, it's going to be a good turnout, I think. Yeah, I think so. I wonder where we want to park, though. There's this big opening here. Desert cleanup. Sign in ahead. So I think we have to sign in. I think they're requiring it sign in. Oh, I see. Um, <laughs> there's tile, and he's waving. Oh no, that's a tile. Right. Good, how are you doing? Good. Okay, here comes Seth. We're gonna, we save spots for you guys up here. Okay. Okay? Main camp, we're gonna get you in front there. <laughs> yeah, you're on camera, sir. <laughs> What's up? Not much. Just how you doing? How you doing? <laughs> you see all that wood? Yeah, I see it. We got it for 25 bucks. Yeah, I know. <laughs> at the, um, what do you call it? At the mall? Yeah. It's pretty cheap there. We're having he, fun. he wanted it all gotten rid of, so he says if you can take it all, you can have it for 25 Nice. So we got some guys over there, badge to help that us. That are going to chop it up and stuff? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're just going to burn it like it is? You've been, so, you heard of Burning Man? <laughs> I want to keep oh, this area free because we're going to get a 40 yard dumpster in. Okay. But if you want to push in a little bit and get close or be far or whatever like if how you want far front and center go ahead and take it how but, where is the dumpsters going the dumpsters, the dumpsters going over there we need about see the line of ninja bob uh -huh. we need about that over see so where anything on this side see where tile is if you want to kind of go well because i have you, sal and sharon well, um, dana that i have well, terry that's what i'm and thinking Scott. if you want to kind of just move forward and line up, up if you want to kind of move kind of wanted up, to do a circle or jerk Either way. So set up right over here even. I mean, get your music so people can hear it at the... Because there's also another the space back there, too. too, behind Chris. Uh-huh. There's another big flat space, too. And that has yeah. its own access if you want to pull back there. But, I don't know. I was thinking, do you like to be in the middle of it all? So that's pretty much right here. Yeah, I don't know. I'll figure it out. Hi, How honey. Are How are you doing? Good. I like your hair color. Thank you. We're She's just... going to be Carolyn. Huh? Caroling. Caroling on oh, Christmas. Uh, caroling on Christmas? Yeah. Awesome. Nomad, nomad Christmas carols. <laughs> yes. Actually, Dana had talked about that. She said, wouldn't it be fun to just go around caroling? <laughs> yeah, I am. Um, Singing I wrote, to everybody. I rewrote the 12 Days of Christmas for oh, the Nomads. I'm scared. It's hilarious. Is it funny? <laughs> yeah. Instead of a partridge in a pear tree, it's a campground that has no fee. <laughs> and a campground that has no fee. Desert cleanup. Who's that? That's Scully. Scully. Scully, Scully arrived at the van build and Jamie didn't know who Scully was. Nobody knew who Scully was. At the end of the van build, he, Scully was tied up to the one of the signposts on the yeah, street. Yeah, I saw that. And it, and it said, thanks, Jamie. And then, and then when Shannon and I went by it, we were like the last people out and it was like well we can't leave it here and so i said well i'll just bring it to events and so if it's if scully is yours uh please let us know what his real name is and claim him but otherwise i'll keep moving him around to yeah he's events. like part of the family now sure he's got a doobie see, his I see doobie? that that's the biggest one i've ever seen in my whole life it's made with uh donkey dung ew uh... yeah but he doesn't have any lungs so he doesn't care yeah. <laughs> Here comes Scott and Terry. 
Well, it's definitely been a long day. I'm going to get parked and situated. Hopefully in the next video, I can give you a tour around this place. There are already a lot of people starting to show up. I'm really excited. So thank you for hanging out with me today. Hopefully we'll see you in the next video. Until then, stay safe and onward bound. I love y'all out there. Bye for now.